but you know, it's all about money. It's all about revenue. Uh, but yeah, like you say, you know, Obama was on transportation a few years back uh, before we even knew it. Back. Across the border project is going where he was in agreement with the Louisville Transportation Secretary before right. he went out. Right. They allow Mexican trucks to run. Right, 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 right. So a lot of people don't get that. All they do is just drove the weights down yes. in the U.S. And, and they don't have to comply with your standards. They do, That's, they do, but they don't. Yeah, they it's do, not but they don't. Yeah. Right. But like I said, coming from there, it's dirt cheap. Yes. So it's squeezed. U.S. is squeezed by Mexico yes. and Canada. Yes. Well, Canada's already running through. So, so do you have your own rig, or do you? I got my own rig, yeah. But uh, like I said, even all uh, like the big companies there, they will. They got their big company got their own equipment. Right, right. But if the company decides they're gonna save money, they'll set you off today, and they'll contract it out to me. Oh well, and the rig just keep dropping. Just, right. just keep dropping. I'm one man, one truck, but like I said, hey. That's what he said. I got you guys. I mean, please let If the farmers are the heartbeat, you guys are the veins. They get the, you know, they're the arteries. Same thing. I mean, if. Farmers get squeezed too. Right? Yeah, small farmer now. Now, you can't compete with the big corporate. Right. But like I said, mom and pop farmer has got two or three acres. Uh, two or three hundred. Right. I think they're thousand acres now, but they can't compete with um, the corporate now. Right. So. How long have you been doing? Uh, I've been trucking, uh, geez. This is, uh, what, about 23? I'll be 50 next, you know, two months. Right? Yeah. So you've seen the changes. Yeah, yeah, this is there. And, and, and what do you see for the immediate future? What do you think is going to happen? I think we're on high tech now. Yeah. It's high tech. Uh, you got companies right now, uh, down the front, but they're, uh, they're doing pilot programs to, uh, say we got autonomous vehicles. The most controlled cars. The most controlled cars. You know. How's it going to fly? I mean, they'd have to they'd have to make my computer run flawlessly 99.9% .9 of the time, which it doesn't. They just did a deal with Budweiser. They just did a autonomous pilot program last month. Out, out west, right? You know, maybe a nice conservative way to move 30,000 pounds on the truck. You got a clean cut guy behind the wheel with a computer, laptop, whatever they are. Just control. But it's but it but they did it. You know, by remote now. Because they were a little bit of a flight to control the airplane. Oh, my three. Okay, I got that. But yeah. now you got a, or on the other end, like I said, now you got to maneuver and track. Could you imagine maneuvering a, a 53 foot tractor trailer right here? The unexpected that come up every day Rain, in your job. Snow, sleep, anything. Good, yeah, 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 I mean, just a, you know, an unexpected yeah. landslide. Oh, oh, you, know. you just said it. Anything. Yeah. Anything you know, the yeah. bridge goes out. You know, anything. That was in Minnesota a few years back. The yeah. bridge went out. Right there in the middle of the drive. And, you know, how many people went out. Yeah, yeah, that was in the news. Yeah, that was, I can't. Uh, you were in that? No, 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 no. But that was made, that was being moved there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It just, just dropped. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's interesting. Uh, the biggest thing in race is just being cut. You know, yeah, people's salary, people salary for the last um, for ten years probably definitely yeah. to, um, Obama. Well, you Obama know, if you're paying attention at all, you know it's about destroying the middle class. Oh, yeah. I mean, I was talk, I was speaking to an auditor out right here a couple of weeks ago from Long Beach, California. Uh -huh. I asked him, like, you know, everybody's talking about California being broke. I was was true. And he goes, I grew up there. I'm going to leave. Okay. He says, they, there's no middle class now. There's the extremely poor that don't know anything, can't do anything. Right. And then you got the ultra rich. So yeah. all the things that need to get done are not getting yeah. done. Because oh, yeah. yeah. they've destroyed the middle class. Yeah. They've run them out. Yeah. Even at, at the biggest, <coughs> one of the biggest examples right now, uh, even down to like uh, one of your, uh, you know, just regular man jobs is like taxi. Yes. My dad was a taxi driver. Yes. But out of Silicon Valley, California, Uber just right. shot the taxi down. Right? It's all about. Yeah, they took the money out of your pocket, set your account up, they'll get a cut. But do you think it's going to succeed? This yeah. Is the, yeah, you think so? I think so, because um, they've already. money talks? Well, they, they got an investment money from uh, Chinese owned firms now. Yeah. So they've grown. They, they're not just US wide, they are somewhat worldwide. They're in more than one country. Yeah, everybody likes it. Yeah, can't lift. 
and the airports, uh, even in uh, our town at Wawa. It, oh, yeah. it was a big hoop to do. So in the last few weeks, it was just announced that now you can ride, share Uber, and Lyft in Atlanta. Right. But what does that mean? Like I said, we're in tourist town now. Right. You know, okay, so you don't have to get a taxi and pay $15. Right. You can get an Uber and pay $8, right. $7. Right. And you don't have to pull any money out of your pocket because you got an iPhone. Yeah. He got an iPhone. And as soon as you get out, once he hits deliver, bam, it goes to his account. And Uber gets their dollar, two dollar, whatever there. Yeah, you know? sure. And yeah. it doesn't matter about how small the rate is. Yeah, no, no. It's because big, yeah. when you got a rate that's two dollars times ten million yeah. times twenty million and how many ever people sure. and everybody's got, you know, doing Uber, they sign you up. What it adds up. What do you think? Because you're obviously a student, you see what's going on, you know what the hell. With these changes, what are we going to do with all these out of work people? You know, uh, with no one working to chip in for the welfare, that's unsustainable. It's, uh, you, you almost going, what was that? Uh, uh, I think it was, I can't think it was France, some European country a few weeks ago, uh, a few months ago. It was basically like uh, they try to. Pull the money out of the pocket and say we're basically we're slowly going to a cash, a, a less cash yeah. society. Oh, yeah, cash yeah. Less. So you, you, yeah. you're used to not having that, but it's almost like um, the, the the work will always be there. The industrialized work will be there, but it'll be somewhere else. It's just trucked in. It's just shipped in. Yeah, but if you're saying that the autom autom automation is going to take over the trucking industry, make it cheaper, Supposedly, and true. the and the AI robots are going to take over more than manufacturing. Uh, uh, I mean, like, you got these you know, the, these guys going $15 an hour to flip burgers, and then they said, okay, well, okay, well, I can do that. It, well, I, they're working on it. Uh, I'll give you an example of the uh, automatic uh, of that. Okay. Even on that, with that uh, water company in Atlanta. Right. Uh, in New York. Uh, what's it? It's, uh, I almost call it National Water, but uh, I'm just going to say water company there. It's just basically bottled water. Bottled water, I think, well, it's bottled water from the East Coast to the Midwest. But right. this particular water company here, <clears throat> when the driver, when we pull up, we hit the gate, you know, to, to the light, you sign in, you know, right. at the um, check in window that you never go in. If you get out, once you're back to the door, if you look under the windows, you got a few people inside the warehouse. But as far as the product being loaded on your truck, you have to perfectly square up to the dock door. Robots load the truck. Yeah, it's just basically yeah. a platform. You know, yeah. they're the uh, they magnets in there. Right. Y'all see that? And there's a program, you know, for the grid. So again, it goes back. That. Now that those guys are so, used to shove the stuff on the truck. So you may have had a hundred people on the clock. Right. So today in that warehouse, I'm going to What are we going to do with the where are those hundred guys? What are they going to do with them? Well, they, they don't even they don't even exist because in that warehouse, you got enough people to quality control the facility. If you perfectly, no, no one no one is for the paperwork that's inside the warehouse. That's the warehouse. Here's the door check outside. You got three people in there, and they check you in right here in the camera. You know, you're giving your pickup, though. Once you perfectly line up at the door, you got maybe two men that work the door to the trailer. All right, so we're talking maybe a dozen men to go ahead. But we're still putting 100 men out of work. That's so, you know, where are the 88? What happened to them? Oh, man. See, that's where it gets dark. That's why I'm wondering, you know, and that's where we got to look at it. Hopefully, try to keep it well. I mean, I... I try to have enough faith in mankind to believe that, you know, we can overcome any challenge. I think it's on the political end. Uh, oh, well, indeed. Know, all of that, yeah. You know, well, of course, I mean, that's what, well, I, I, that's what this whole election was about, is a revolution about getting the government off our back and having them stop lying to us. And, uh, you know. I, think, I think more like my dad said, we got to more divided now. Oh, indeed. Well, any time, we were getting to a point, you understand, it's like Trump said it when he got in. You know. <laughs> I, I like it. Uh, you know, when he first got in, he says, when he his nomination speech, he said, nationalism, not globalism, will yeah. be our credo. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because the push was, indeed, to force yeah. globalization, the yeah. prices down worldwide, oh, yeah. 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 and yeah. create this one world government with yeah. the elites at top, yeah. and, you know, us just piddling down here. 
yeah. trying to survive or yeah. not surviving right. at the bottom. Yeah. Oh, That's yeah. why they opened up the FEMA camps. Oh, come oh, on man. in. We'll feed you the oh, GMO yeah. foods. Oh, yeah. And, oh, yeah. You know, and you can check yeah. in, but you ain't checking out kind of routine. And, and that's a great way of saying all the Exactly. Yeah. Well, a lot of people don't want to hear that. Like, they shut down military base. A lot of shut down military base down. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but, they, but they've shut down the military bases and turned them into FEMA camps. Yeah, yeah. Well, like a lot of Build it and they shall come, right? Yeah. Well, if they don't come, we'll go get them. Yeah, but they, see, I don't see There's too many people awake. Just know what the globalists are doing. They're losing on every front. Brexit, Trump getting in. Uh, I mean, Le Pen in France. Merkel's going to go down. Davos is meeting this week. And China's going to show up. Basically, what's going to be on the agenda is how do we stop this populism? How do we stop the bleeding? The, they're finding out about us. The knowledge, once they're put in the light, they're destroyed. They're like cockroaches. They have no power once they are shown. But still, we got to deal with the problems we were just talking yeah, about yeah. because they're not going to stop. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But, like I said, people that have information, the old people, older people that know. Uh, that, that's another divine because the young people coming up, you know, you shoot them information constantly and they're programmed. Yeah. Programmed in the school. Yeah, we've all been down. programmed. Yeah. But, you know, yeah. some of us are stupid enough to get out of the programming yeah, 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 or whatever. Yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's the truth. Yeah, it, it's raining, but maybe it's not raining. Maybe it's, it's in, you know, maybe just uh, on the acid. But you guys know how to get out of the acid now, <laughs> you know. Well, some people don't believe me. So you would have passed my my uh, sanity test today. I was going to, you know, you, my question today was, you passed the liberal sanity test. <laughs> because, you know, because I'm seeing people say things now that are on their face value yeah. and believing them that don't exist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. And, and, you know, and it's blatant, but you said the divide is yeah. so... Oh, yeah, yeah. So yeah. Yeah. And that's what I like to throw out before, yeah. because you know that this is how these are polarizing. You know, to get started, it's talked about this incredible divide. Because right, right. yeah. that's what they want to do. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They want to keep us divided. Oh, they want yeah. us fighting yeah. against one another. Oh, yeah. They want us They ain't killing me at the same time. Amen. Not just everybody. Like I always say it now, the media, the media always show cops, oh, and they're showing, you know, whites being, at least whites oppressing blacks. But also, local news in my town, too, there's a, another story that you don't see. Because the same way the media show these mean white cops killing black folks, we got some cops here local of color look like, and I say some black families sitting there crying over their families too. They just got shot, they just got beat down, just got shit by the police. Right. And this story never got out. We all think we're in the end. Amen. You know? Yeah. We know that. I mean, that's, they've lost all credibility. Yeah. This is, if there's anything that really came out of this election, like President Trump did this, this you know, it's, Press conference. I mean, just oh yeah, yeah. You know, it, it, you know. On that, people were quick to say Trump's stupid and all that. Trump is a big. I, I would not want to play poker with that. Oh no, I got it. I, I can't. I don't take nothing from him, man. Yeah. Hey, my dad said, hey, you got money on that. Man. Yeah. I'll see people that do what you want. Now, he generally. And also, if you got that many enemies, you got to be doing something right. You, you, you know, that's the truth. <laughs> yeah, and he probably got them on the payroll too. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. oh. Yeah, the more I'm finding out and researching about this man, the more impressed I am yeah. with what he's doing. He's got some good Oh, yeah. Yeah, he got some contact. When you know that ain't money, don't even mean anything because it's basically you're just pointing and it's done. Yeah. Plus, he's been, I mean, he's, from what I can gather, he's been cleverly behind the scenes, seeing how all the gears yeah, for a long were time. all, yeah, for a long time. Keeping, yeah. Why and playing the dummy? Yeah. You yeah. know. And now he's just going. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Pull the switches. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. That's true. Yeah. And even uh, I would say my teens when we see him off and on in the media, yeah. we're in the eighties now. I think that never been. Yeah. But from then to age fifty now. Yeah. Now. I asked my dad, I said, you think he's going to be president? He's going to be president. Uh, he's going to be president. Be president. Yeah. I did. He said, uh, it's, it's about power. You know? yeah. And I was like, well, yeah. we got the money. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so you want the power to yeah, power. But the power to do what? That's the question. I mean, is he just going to be another uh, opportunist? 
you know, or is he going to follow through with some of the things he's said? So far, he's, I think, I'm about an 80% approval rating on what he's been doing. I mean, uh, just coming out and saying things, like, even the thing that really made me just work my ears up about him and go, what the, what? It was a year ago, he said this, is a he says, if you elect me president, you will find out who really far down the Twin Towers. Yeah. Now, you know, yeah. we got all them stories out there. You can figure some of that, you know. Uh, I would say the biggest, uh, and, well, in two words, people would say exploded. Well, a building exploded that fall like that, implode. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty, yeah. almost everybody that's done a cursory. Uh, investigation into the 9-11 yeah. knows that at the very least we've been lied to yeah. Oh, yeah. dramatically. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the worst, of course, collusion with the government yeah. agencies yeah. and all. Yeah. So, we you know that's why these guys have lost credibility oh, over yeah. the years. Yeah. It goes on and on. But, you know, and they could have come out the slap the CIA. Yeah. I mean, the last guy that said, I the CIA needs to be smashed yeah. a million pieces with Kennedy. Yeah. What did they do to him? They smashed his head. So, he, as again, I go back to Trump so far has been showing me some real good movies. You know, but I don't know how it's going, but I like it. It's refreshing. I would say they all, I, I would say they, they all work together, you know, on that end. Yeah, oh sure. Uh, and they all, they all collaborate together. You either sell out to it or you fight it. Yeah, yeah. When they end, like you say, it's divided, but as tyranny rises, so does yeah. its resistance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, sure. Sure. Where do you get most of the information from? Obviously, on the road a lot, so... You see stuff, you see stuff driving down the street, you read it, you just bump in the uh, The news will say one thing, but you can either read it for face value and let it go, or you can just go back. Because this story will have two miles behind it, and nothing can get rid of it at the same time. You know, well, so you're like done. your own Facebook. You go around and just talk to people as you're driving around. And uh, sometimes you just stand there while they're talking, and you don't say that. You just listen. You're talking my language out here, man. This is what I do all day. Uh, get out of jail free card for Puerto Rico. Oh yeah, okay, okay. Oh yeah, gotta get it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, all right. Are you a Michael? Yes, sir. Okay, I'm Richard. Pleasure talking. Nice to meet you, bro. Hey, you take care now. All right. Hope to see you a year from now. Maybe, uh, you know, we can talk what happened with our projection. Hey, you know? hey, we'll see. Yeah, it's going to be interesting. Oh yeah. God bless you, bro.